World Chicago is coming up real quick. We are just uh, parting out. This is four U sets here. These are the drawers I pulled out that I'm going to add. Some already have parts in them, but that's sort of the black and the dark bluish gray. While I was watching basketball last night, and then there's the rest of it. It's a lot of light bluish gray, but the rest is not too much of one color. There's only you know, one and a little bit of white, blue. Actually, there's a number of dark tan, but they're bigger pieces too. This is the Arrowhead set. Most of the ship. I'd say 70, 80% of the ship. And then, um, Battle. The Battle one with Kylo Ren and Maz from Episode 7, I think. And two RV campers. And there's one other one. I can't remember what it was. Anyway, so, it's all these parts. It's, uh,. Just, I just cleared off my camera to upload or to do a video. And we have 2,200 parts it's starting at. $254. There's 637 lots, so uh, it's definitely going to go down from there. So I'm guessing it's going to be in the five low 500 lot range, maybe even 400. Definitely under 2,000 parts, and then uh, I'm guessing this will be more like 180 would be a good estimate. I already deleted the minifigs that were not here, so. Let's go. Let's do it. A lot of consolidation. I went through a few few parts here, and then so there's going to be a lot less lots once I just say yes to all of it. Whether they're here or not, it doesn't matter. I have to verify each part and the quantity as I go through it. So 58 finished. So now we're down to 568 lots. So so that's like I said, I only had one of these, but I found two. And that's about it. So see, that's how that's how it is when you're dealing with partial sets. You just gotta roll with what you can find. Oops, whoops! I just put two and everything. Two there, and then that's in drawer U zero four one five. Keep going. We're getting close to the end. I got just got the light bush gray done. I was just happy to get that done. So I'm not sure how many are left. I guess I can do can shift end. So it says 149 more lots to kind of go through. So. Um, that's where we're at, and it's looking like a lot of parts on this table here. Therefore, now we're at 460 total, so we did 300. We already did 300 lots, so in about two hours, or just just under two hours right now, into this. The last parts are put away. All consolidated. Although there's a the other, yesterday I did I did I did not consolidate about 80 lots. I mean, not that they all were already in my store, but I didn't even check. I just put them in a different drawer and selected not to consolidate. So something that I'm trying out for a few things, but not not, not everything I do that for. But when it's convenient and time saving, as it will be, the way I see it, I may do it more. Uh, but this is all those parts that ended up being 1,868. 401 lots and 163 dollars so the dollar amount really went down i did run over there quite a few times and just grabbed quantity of things that i like i know i have a bunch of those sorted already so i just added to the number so this uploaded holds this stuff that i just bought out of the bulk so i parted out sets from that bulk i just got and you saw the numbers there one of those sets two of the sets there's there an old older slave one in there which was not even half there which I parted out but the big arrowhead set probably about 80 bucks of that um, and so then the, this is other parts that I had in there uh, that I pulled out so I'm gonna get these all listed and then work, move on to this is bag was in there of accessories there's a whole nother bag of accessories I already pulled out all these good accessories or animals that were in there not all good but just stuff that was unique I want to pull out some more bigger stuff so I'm just gonna go through and get all this listed much as I can today before I just start not doing this for a while to get completely ready for Chicago. Actually, my son is working for me today for four hours. He's, I asked him. He's going to get the mini, build the manifestations completely ready, which is really the only major thing on my list. Um, things like that. Now, 
this was working in the eBay listing and it was only so it does have a little bit of yellowing on it which it does only 55 bucks plus about 10 bucks shipping so it was the best deal I had I don't know I wasn't look for, looking for this but it just came in my feed so why not why not um let's put them up here Lloyd get that out of there solid spent a solid three hours I got all that cleared up over there so um this is the final 212 lots 343 items let's price it up last six months sales average 195 so slow going on stuff today but definitely i mean for the cost of the stuff you know it, it makes sense you know you can add a lot more value in parts on new sets but you're paying a lot more for it so but i don't i like that process better but baby bottle did not get added it's just there and i just got to put this away and all this set up away and call it a day package for chicago for my good friend that's awesome i was supposed to get 50 of these but the person never got them so oh, that's an interesting print on a dinosaur it's pretty cool oh what's this one love one heart bob marley this is for the child one love <laughs> one heart that's pretty cool wow they're buying more baby clothes i've sent those some before it doesn't say the size there but it should be she's wearing six to nine months so awesome they said they went to new york city so actually he sent me a picture he was at the lego store and the Rolling Stones. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I might dress the baby like that, but we'll see if the other half wants to. I mean, they're really nice shirts. It's just the stuff. We got this Batman 1992. There's like eight or seven or eight of these, and then there's seven or eight of these. I have 15 total poly bags in here. That guy's got a cool face. It's a cool Kai all together. I had wrapped his temple battle. And then 75 more. I felt like I didn't have enough um, of some of the characters. So I'm like, just give me 75 more. And we'll deal with it if I run out. I run out of one. I hope I run out of all of them. That's That would be just the best. So, awesome. There. Cars on eBay. And two, actually two sports cards sold. That's most in a while. In about a month. Um... So June 9th is the day on Friday, 7 on BrickLink, 1 on BrickLink. Now before I go over the numbers, I, don't, I didn't see them yet, but I think I had six, five or six hours on BrickLink. They're all like five lots or less when I last checked last night. And I, the one on BrickLink was like 20-some, I think, I saw. It was 31. 31 lots, 32 total lots in seven orders. 63 total lots, 152. Uh, half of what I would hope for in a day for monetary, but gotta take what you can get. Um, they may end up putting on, um, no, as I say, I might put on another sale this weekend, but I've been, I've been lowering prices actually. So that's, I was trying to figure out a pricing strategy. And I think I, I just had stuff like between five and 10% below the averages to try to lead people in. This week I was doing that a lot. So, um, so yeah, I'm gonna start pulling these, get this over with, and then, What's on my list? I gotta complete my videos, they're all uploaded. I gotta work CMFs for Brick World. So I gotta, um, cause I just got these in. I gotta open those and then I have, get my stuff out and check my series 23 and 24. Um, make sure I have enough of those. Final space bar of the day, 6.15 a.m. And I'm gonna pack this up and just Relax the rest of the day. That's it. To work on is the mail. Just one item. Why did I buy these? I think they were less than a half a cent each. I don't know. Um, I came to the store because they had a good quantity of these and I was low on these. So why not buy a hundred? So we got some Thunder Keepers. 
I think it's just that one. Just those two. 0.4 cents each. And what it's like a, the size of a pickup brick cup for like, it's like 12 bucks for this. Would I even buy this at a store? Put it fill up a cup like that? Probably not. Oh well. So my cost is 327. My shipping was like 30 bucks on top of that, so I'm gonna I'm gonna readjust all the prices and see what the six months sales average is. 705. So cannot beat that. I'm gonna be parting out a bunch of these too, so the price will go up get a little bit more. Because um, those are going average is a four dollars and I'll sell them on eBay too and then three to only three twenty seven for the scoop on average so yeah, we'll get this bulk order got some more stuff for uh, brick world I also put a bunch of stuff to eBay but it ended up being like four hundred fifty dollar upload so that was pretty good and um, I'm gonna clean up figure out what am I doing next don't know I got my videos done I can click those off the list uh, verify sets I need to do. I need the dog. Call the dog. The vet to get her updated on her shots. So, um, hmm. I have sets I have to complete. Let's see if my light works. It works. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six sets I need the pictures and um, to make them look nice like. These ones, like this one, I printed the picture on the side, so I think I'm going to do that now. That's a pretty nice and calm job, so then I'll get into the CMF stuff, which is in here. Actually, i got to pull out my bins for Brickworld before I do that, so and kind of organize some stuff in the bin, one of bin. So, when you're getting loaded up, i got to get these priced and put in a box to take. Series, what, series 6 Mario, I have a bunch of those. Actually, there's a Series 5. <clears throat> um, these are just extra mini things that I have to figure out how many of these I'm going to take. Because <laughs> I think I got a lot. But I do need, I need to like kind of fill up some of these themes. Like there's not many space in there, which I just added a few. Two green future on ones. And I've added some Harry Potter. Friends could use a little help, but actually a lot of that stuff is actually in here and in here. This is just for my $6 stand, which is ready to go, things that I'm going to put on there. So a lot of these, but actually go into some of these, so I don't really see the, I don't really see how many I have of some, because there could be a bunch of space in there. I know there's a bunch of friends in here, so I don't think I need to worry about it. I think I'm pretty stocked up, but I'll, I'll bring a bag of this at least, or sort out. 30% of this into some of these themes that I have lined up. Just uh, a lot of different variety on hand. I gotta take this, all my damaged parts. People buy these up like crazy. There's some good things in there as far as hands. Hand, you'll, you'll find extra hands in there for two bucks. You could probably find 10 hands in a bag. Different color hands. A bunch of other stuff, people use them for whatever. Stop motions. You don't always need the quality parts. But got that I gotta take. Yeah, a little bit to do. One of those sets I really just gotta um got an eBay order and yesterday, so I'm gonna sort this out. Get the complete figs out of there that I maybe can take. These are some motorcycles I have to bag up for the a three dollar bin. I guess this is the good stuff pulled out. This Jaguar has a red eye, one red eye, did somebody color that? And it's got a little bite marks, it might go on eBay as photoed and as is, um, but yeah, it's an interesting Minecrafter. Alright, last photo is uh, here, I could just quit here, but I like to fill out the sides. Cut that out and put that on there nice. Finish it up. Alright, there we go. Already. I just gotta price them up. So, it's good. Boxes of sets. 
pull. Ready to go. This one actually closed for me. Well, maybe. I mean, I can. R2D2 is in the way. It'll close. Um, and those are lots of other ones. It's all good to go. Um, I have this box I'm going to fill up too, I think, or I might find a bigger box if some sets don't really fit in there because I still have. Definitely got to take this and this. I got these I got to pack up for sure. Um, maybe a few more of these. Like, definitely one of these. Or both of them, probably. So they they will sell at a decent price. Um, oh yeah, I, got, I want to definitely do these pirate ones I just got. So I'm gonna take these space squads. A lot about parting them out and selling um, the magenta with the dark purple, or the dark pink with the dark purple. But this this is actually a better value to sell them at like 40 bucks or 50 bucks, and I have to have to check the prices. Um, but yeah. My bags, all sets, everything I'm taking, priced and ready to go. Not, not, there's two bags, or actually three bags of extra poly bags that are not priced. I mean, all these are. So, it's all right. And I gotta get these over here. And then I just finished my build a minifig station yesterday. We got all these ready to go, all four. I probably only have three out on the table at one time and then um, and I got extras got extra heads if I need them which I don't think I, I will but it'll look pretty bare on Sunday by the time Sunday comes I'm not not pretty bare but I probably can get down to three cases and make them all full again some extra legs and then extra just figures that are that I can rip apart and put in there some common stuff so always I will always come over prepared I hope and I hope I need to be over prepared because that means that's a good weekend. So, so that's all ready. This is this, we'll get this put together when when we get there. But we added that extra row up there, so I can add eight, eight more. And now I'm just gonna work on Bricklink. I think on eBay the rest of the day because it is just about noon. I'm gonna take a break here. Um, I have to list on eBay. Work the same so I'm not gonna do that because I did other things that I wasn't planning on doing, like getting all those sets ready. So I will do that on. Monday when I pull out. I just don't want to pull out all this stuff yet. But Monday I'll pull it all out and get it all over there until we pack it up. Time to start working eBay. Took a break break and got the mail so that we can complete a few more figures before we photograph stuff. All that goody goodness. I think order completed. Eight items for eBay actually there was two that I got photographed so there's ten of them. And then some more stuff that I'm going to take to Brick World some graduates. And also adding $84 and 18 new lots to the Brooklyn store. So, there we go. Master, I put for sale over a year ago. So I got to figure out where I put them. I want to say they might be in the drawer, but they might not be. No, they're definitely not in there. The only other spot they'd be is with my other ones, I think. Yeah, I think they're just in here. I mean, it's a guess. <laughs> 1472. Um, actually, this is where I put stuff that's for sale. Right? The end. It's in this case. <laughs> I made I made cards and everything for them because um, I thought I'd start selling them. But I'm not gonna. They look so nice. Fourteen seventy-two. There it is. If I had a quicker way to make cards like this, maybe I'd continue it. Um, I mean, they're four bucks each. Or more. There's actually quite a few more that are more expensive. This is full of those cases. Um, this is an old camera. I've actually taken home pictures with this camera and developed them and made our own masters. That's like six, seven years ago. So I was early into it. I wasn't someone that sat there and looked at them a lot, but this is the Riviera in France. Um, 
that was interested in the process or the history of it. So there is, I believe, six or nine of those full, like absolutely packed full in there. I'm not sure the this one's not full. There's a lot of empty things here. That's all my empty ones. These cases alone, I was selling them for over 10 bucks each. These are like the original when they first came out. And I think I have a few in here. One, two, four of them. Four of those cases right there. And all these ones are made in Belgium, which are more rare or something, at least for this area. Anyway, enough of that. We sold one. That's all. I have something to part out again. Had a little bit of luck at my local Walmart. There's a ton of stuff on clearance. This one was from 29 or for 30 from whatever, almost 30 bucks to 19 something. So I believe get 16 of those. There's other ones that I wanted to get, but they just didn't have, didn't have a quantity. And I don't know if I'm ever get to another Walmart before the clearance is up. So yeah, it doesn't hurt to get some, but these are, the prices were not good enough to get any more. So there's oh, like there's more They're there. There's 16, 17 of them actually. Thought there was 16 of them. Check out, but I scanned 17. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. That's what I paid for. I got 22 orders on eBay. Sold a $60 base set in there. And without the box. So 6, 10, June 10th. 6 on Brick Link, 3 on Brick All. Brick All showed up today. Thank you. 437 items, 117 lots, 248. So decent. Definitely um, gonna take it. I do have one Berkeley order for Chicago so, so far. Don't have much time to get any more $20 order. Uh, how many lots was it? It's like 30 lots or something. So mostly little pieces. Do that. We might not do that till Monday, but actually. I'll probably have time today. I'll just do it after I pull these and get these done. So it's out of the way. So let's go. 7.30, I got the order for Brickworld packed up. That reminds me of grabbing Lloyd. I forgot to take him to uh, Brickworld, Milwaukee. So he's got to go to Chicago. Maybe we should bring the other Lloyd. With Captain Rex, I got up there. So anyway, done. Uh, now I got 25 items on eBay that were photographed yesterday. We list those up and and just do whatever from there. Trying to figure out how to bring as much as possible to Brick World Chicago. So we got this trailer, one of these can fit, and then on this tote, which I'm not using, but I could use it for something. Hmm. Oh, I disturbed them. They're all laying together. Lots of Chicago running through my head fast. Ooh. It is 5 a.m. on a Monday. Big Monday for me. 86 items on eBay to ship, to ship out, so. Yeah, busy. The book we got last year for a dollar. Let's figure out where it is. Oh, we're over here. This one, this is a $33 sale. The Pirate by Sir William Scott. Is that what I said? Sir Walter Scott. So one of the sweetest looking book covers I've ever seen. That I've actually not seen, but I've owned. That's sweet. Absolutely amazing order here. Dark Purple Space Man. Just under 50 bucks for that one, so that's awesome. And then there's all these. You got like um, the entire Ninja Turtle set. Agent Coulson is in here. The gamer from Dimensions. A lot of SpongeBob. So we're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, I also sold a set. This is the Dark Forest Men set for almost 90 bucks. So that's really good. So we had a really good eBay weekend that was needed. All right, we are loading the stuff with both Chicago's this weekend. And there it goes. June 12th, 
we ended up with the last 48 hours of time. 26 Bricklink orders and 8 Brickout orders. I did put a sale on just sets and minifigures, so definitely uh, sold an expensive set to Australia. The most expensive, no, maybe the most expensive one I had for sale, probably. So, I don't have very many sets for sale. 34 total orders is great. 2,500 items, 486 lots. Wow. So, this is definitely hitting the goal I needed at this point in the, in the game. Um, to keep on pushing forward so I don't know if I show this I got some mail in Saturday uh, more foil bags and paper bags one brickly order one eBay order on top so we'll go to that later but I gotta be busy now let's go 12 has a message here would love to see this picked on your channel I'm a huge fan tap Lloyd for me <laughs> okay well let's see what they can do we have some footage here so 644 there we go. There's Lloyd. Light, lighting up, light up Lloyd for you. Stay there. Two of those. Eighteen. Baby's coming, so we'll see at the end what happens. Um, no baby yet. Um, so we got the new parts. So I'm gonna run over the used. Use wall. 96 has a screwdriver in it. Apparently, I have to dump it out to find it. There's one. Come on. It's difficult with one hand. Here we go. 108. Is, uh, Three minutes and 49 seconds. There it is. Big order of the weekend. It's 11 lots. First they want the space plate. So I gotta get a good box for that. Actually, it might actually fit in the box I'm grabbing. The whole order, I'm not sure. I guess I didn't look at the set number. So it's this one. It will not fit in this box, but I'll be gonna make a bigger box for it. Anyway, so what do we got here? This is going to Australia. So I got a base plate and then sold the bank, town bank, for $240. I had 20% off sale on sets, which apparently at $300 it was not selling, so we got it for sale. We're sold. That's the goal, folks. Sell it. Sell it while you can. I mean, I don't know, this this the instructions sold for like almost 200 at one point because the parts, the rest of the parts are not that uncommon, like the stickers maybe. Um, but this is just such a rare set that the instructions are what people would want because you can literally build it, most likely, unless you can find the sticker parts, I guess. The instructions, I gotta protect all that up and pull the rest of the order here. It's not much here, 42. And they only charged them. 1995. I mean, I have a limit where you can only buy up to 13 ounces of items off my store internationally. So I was surprised this went through, but it did do an invoice. So even if it's going to cost me more than normal, they bought an expensive set. I don't mind covering a little bit of it. You know, it's about making the sale, getting it gone, making a little bit, bringing back the capital. There's two of those. I, can, I cannot. Of uh, international orders, I usually double check them. These are pretty small, because I don't want. I mean, I'm not gonna obviously send another thing out for $15. If I miss a dollar item. That's just not something you should do. But it's disappointing, and I don't like to disappoint. This drawer has an issue. I don't remember what it was. Oh, it's a train thing. So we'll go. We'll, we'll go in through the top. See if we can get the, there. It is. I think it's just one. Let me double check. No, there's three of them. So this will solve the problem of not opening. If I can get all. Well, yeah. Once I got the one out, then I can get in there. 
two. There's number three. All right. Problem solvers in this business. You gotta be a problem solver. Always running into things. And one last part is a 907, which is a stud with three blue, three buttons blue. 907 over here. A stud with three buttons blue. Don't know. There's no picture of the piece for some reason. Oh, a suit. It's a, it's a figure. But there's no picture. It's a minifigure. Suit. So we got one of those three, two sharks, one, the rest is one. Okay, we're good. So that was a nice order of $312. Boom. Boom, boom. That's what I like. Officially halfway done. We're halfway through this order. We'll be halfway done. I had 35 orders. I, there was one other one that came through and I redid the program. And, picked it up so it comes out today i am back for an eighth purchase to pick up some more goodies for some upcoming mocks all right i know before this guy did a jazz club he's talking about so he sent a picture i think it's in what probably over a year ago video so let's do this one up one two three four five six seven eight nine ten but too bad there we go for, for a fan of the channel thanks again Heading down south. This order was 93 lots. It's 10:30 in the morning. I was I was holding the sweet little baby half the half of that one. So and everything else is all the orders or everything is there. Just gotta pack it up. Um, move on. Uh, if sh free shipping is working out in my favor, I do this every once in a while. So I received 109.54 for shipping costs for all these orders and all orders but two which is the one that's going to Australia, and I had one priority there, or costing me 132 So, paying a little extra rate already, but I mean, for what I, the amount of sales I had, it's pretty good. Uh, it's just, you just have to roll with it, and not think of it as a loss, it's just you're trying to create, create sales. So I ended up paying $50 out of my pocket to ship 36 orders, so, or 35 orders, so it cost me $1.42, uh, out of my pocket for each of those packages which it's a small price but um, I just like to evaluate this every few months see how it, it's, it's a lot of orders that come out because most days it's like 10 15 dollars I pay out of my pocket when you're talking about 10 to 15 orders so and I kind of average out what is it per package so it's usually about 80 cents to a dollar per package on an average day so this is a little higher but I had international um, one pri I only had one priority, so it wasn't too crazy, but yeah, just got a lot of orders. That's what I needed. Let's get the process of this. Um, and this seller, man, they have like 20 negative and neutral feedbacks, all for slow shipping, basically. I ordered this on May 15th and it got here. And they didn't ship it out until June 4th. That's. And I kept on saying, I, I absolutely need this in the mail by June 13th before I go to Chicago. <laughs> like, oh yeah, I'm going to have exams. I'll get it next next Thursday. And that was like Memorial Day weekend, May here. So, like, okay. <laughs> um, I just I absolutely need it to it'll be a problem if it doesn't get here in time. It didn't, so whatever. So I just hate to have to send messages like that to people. So... May 15th, so 16 days in May, it didn't go out in four, so 20 days it took them to send this, to get it in the mail. They must have sent it a fast way to, a faster way, because um, it only took like nine days or something, is that right? Seven days? Actually seven days from the day they actually dropped it off the post office. So, yeah, i to get this sorted and some of this stuff will be uploaded to Bricklink right now and the rest price stuff. Some of it may be kept for the next shows coming up. So these are sealed and I've had to replace one was missing a head, one was missing a torso. So I had one here and then I was able to complete these with those with the one that was missing a head but it had the torso and and this one I just opened has no torso. 
I don't know what's going on. This one has no legs. They're not in there. It's ridiculous. How can this be? Like, does this person get like rejects and they're selling them? I, I really hope it's not the same with these. Because that would be not good. What is going on? Let's open one more just to see what happens. There's no head. Okay, well I better take the five I put on my Brickling store for sale out of there because... <sighs> like I said, I hope... I don't really want to open one right now, but I'll get one to get to it, I will. Hey, that one's complete! We got a complete one. Open, had everything, but it had an extra pair of legs. They're so wacky. This is so wacky here. Well, let's see. I'm, I'm gonna open 20, and I'm gonna. I just deleted the ones on my store, and we'll see what we end up with. Cause I'm bagging up the completes as we go, and I'm not sure how many I actually opened yet. But I had 20, so we'll see. Seek and find game because the last one I just did did not have a torso, so I had to throw it in there. And this one has two torsos and everything else. So now that made this one bag completed the last one. <laughs> but the last one had two legs and no torso. So 20 and this is, um, I have two, torso, uh, two torsos and three legs in there and one, two, three, four, five armors. There's a lot of, a lot of them had extra armor with uh, two armors in there. So we got out of 20 bags open, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16. We end up with 17 completes. You can tell. So it takes, it only takes three body parts to complete it. So one, two, three, one, two. We're short four body parts in all those bags to come. So basically we were short uh, one torso and three heads. Or we could add 20, which we paid for and ordered, but oh well, that's life in this business sometimes, so get this all taken care of and move on to this one. Oh. What is that? That's wild. They, did, they taped that up in there. They give you all that for this? That's pretty cool. So right away, we have a good one. Woohoo! I mean, obviously I'm gonna open up probably 10 of these, there's 50. There's no issues and I'll just assume they're all good. Um, these are like one out of every three had a, had a weird situation. Chargers in here, a couple small things. Got that bus. And then you've got this pile we just pulled up, this guy out of. The head is awesome. There's nicks on the torso, but all I need is a head to complete one, so nice. Another Brick World Chicago order. We got 35 minifix, $50 order. Awesome. Tuesday morning, final shipping before Brick World Chicago. We won't be shipping on Wednesday, so I had a um, good amount of, this is 14 parcels sold here, so good amount of stuff here. Order pulling for the last next seven days because there's no mail on Monday, June 19th. So eight orders on Bricklink, one on Brickall. My stores are closed now. 960 items, 149 lots, $243. So there's one order that is 62 lots. And this one came in after I closed it, the 25 lots. I do have it where you can still place orders. Uh, it just has a note that it's going to be delayed. So. I don't have it open to the public. I'll probably reopen my store later in the week on Friday so that it's just open so I do have a normal weekend of sales. Okay, I can do that on Tuesday when the mail runs again, so let's go. An order for a awesome fan of the channel. Some enforcement torsos and three of the 
one's a paper bag, two foil bags. Shazam. Now I have a prime piece of real estate entrance. Uh, 40 steps and you're at my booth. Bob's Block Shop, there it is. Entrance, yes. That's awesome. As a note, it's been a long time since I've have bought anything from your store, but I always watch your videos. And you had everything that I was looking for. Thank you for that. You're welcome. Yeah, it just it's a process of continuing to buy stuff and continuing to upload it. Keep uploading. That's the hashtag. Thank you for watching. And we'll have to get this order off camera because it's a lot of counting. <laughs> a hundred, lots of uh, good stuff. So awesome. Thank you again. Got to get these. Prepped. We got another order for Brickworld for my um, the person that's placed the most orders in my Brickling store. We'll be at the booth once again. I've only seen them in Bay Beach and Green Bay, but they live a lot closer to the Chicago Schaumburg show, so awesome. Until the next one. Thank you.